Hey guys, it's Brynn and welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to be talking about bullies, but specifically online because like our generation, it's kind of a big issue. I was just going to talk about like why, like how I cope with people who make fun of me or like, um, like say mean things about me because it's like it almost hurts worse behind just like when you don't know the person because it's like behind a screen if that makes sense but like it's never really bothered me because all i think about is they're literally i don't, I don't know who this person is like who knows what they're going through if it makes them feel better to make fun of me then go at it like i honestly don't care um they're just probably jealous of you. I've never like cried over people make fun of me online. Like, and I know there's people who have, and I just wish I could tell them like, why do you care so much? Like, they literally don't matter. Like, um, like people who, I've had people who make fun of me to my face and it still doesn't bother me. Like, I've just always been that person that like, I, I don't really care. <laughs> like, I don't know how to say it. Like, I, I don't care what you have to say about me. Like, everyone has their own opinions and um, some people are just miserable and sad and they feel the need to make fun of somebody. Like, I've had adults make fun of me. Like, I don't get what their point is. Like, I don't really care. Like I said, I don't care. Like, that's probably, like, I, I just wish I could get across to you guys and like, get bothered by it. Like, don't, like, you shouldn't care. Like, literally, like, don't listen to it. And I've, I've had Kill Bren pages. I've had you should die, you should kill yourself, like, I don't get why, like, I honestly don't understand what goes through somebody's head telling, like, a, a 13 year old girl to kill herself, like, I hope you feel better, honestly, like, I've had a girl harass me over text that I'm a slut, I should die, like, I don't, like, I don't even deserve to breathe, like, I've had texts like that. And from a 19 year old girl, like literally, and I just never understood it, but I didn't even, it just made me so frustrated that she just felt the need to do it. I wish I could talk to her and be like, why, like, are you, like, are you mad at something? Like, are you taking it out on me? It's crazy because, like, someone gets judged for something. Like, everyone, society is like, be yourself, don't let anybody tell you different. But then there's like girls trying to change for what people want them to be. Specifically girls, I would think, because girls have an image of you have to be perfect, you can't like uh, like screw around or like, I don't know. And like when you do, it's like a huge like deal and it just shouldn't like, people get judged. Um, like society, yeah, society's like, be yourself, and then you get judged for it by people. I would say bullying was really bad when I was on the show because a lot of people didn't like the reason why I came into the show and, like, how I came into the show. And that's probably when it was at its worst. And it's just, like, people are always watching you, like, especially when your life is broadcasted online. Like, everyone's always watching you and waiting for you to make a mistake. Of course, I've addressed people who take it too far, but some girls might do it for attention. Like, bullying people, they might do it for attention. They might do it because they're sad. They might do it because they're lonely. And the best way to respond to it is just, like, ignore it or just don't respond to it or just... Treat others the way you want to be treated, okay? Golden rule. I've always had, like, my sister. I would say my sister. I've always talked to her about it because she's, like, so, me and my sister are really close. So, And my sister actually gets, she got really, like, badly beat down and bullied online because they were comparing me and my sister, which is, like, crazy because, like, we're two different people. But... It, it honestly makes me more mad when people would make fun of my sister than me because I don't care about me, but like if you attack my sister, I will come after you. So, yeah, so Sadie's always talked to me about it. Like I've always had to, I've always had somebody to talk to you about, but I know that there's people that don't, and so it's especially hard for them to try to swallow it on their own, if that makes sense. Like take it in on their own, which 
I know it's hard, but like I'll I've had fans that I've talked to about like people bullying them or little girls like from my school that I've talked to because their friends are being mean to them. Like so if you should always find someone that you need to talk to, whether it's even your dog, like literally just you should always have someone to talk to because just don't let them take you down, basically is what I'm saying. There's specific comments that might stick in your head like forever and like I've definitely have have had people say stuff that like I'll kind of freak out about and I won't forget it, but in like like five years when you're doing something else and you don't know the people like you're not going to even remember. So it might seem like a big deal now, but it's really not. You just have to put it in like perspective. The biggest thing I just want to like make clear is that just be the bigger person in a situation. If someone's making fun of you or like who knows what their goal is in doing it. Like I've never understood what the goal of being a bully is. But yeah, just be the bigger person and you should always have someone to talk to if you're having a tough time. Like. I'll even always talk to you. I'm sure your parents would talk to you or your cousin or your friend. Like, just talk to anybody about it because it's way better to tell someone than just keep it inside. Yeah, that's all I really have to say. I kind of talked a lot. I talked pretty good. I don't want this video to be long because it's just me talking. I hope that this video, if you're a person who struggles with it, I hope that it helped you because, like, for me, like looking at, like I've never cared about what people say about me ever. I've always just done whatever, like I do not care. And I'm just trying to like show you guys like why it doesn't matter what people think about you. So yeah, um, this was kind of a more like serious video because I usually do dumb, stupid videos of me like messing around all the time because I don't care what people think about me. That's why I do stupid stuff. Um, yeah, so make sure to, you know, just give this video a like if it helped you and comment down on the video ideas and make sure to subscribe so that you guys can see more videos I come out with. So yeah, thank you so much. Thank you so much for watching and I love you guys and I will see you in the next video. So peace out.